right, guys. So um, I had some questions with people having a tight thoracic spine, so when they're rounded, so you get some tightness and tension as well in the upper back on between the shoulder blades area. So some really great uh, ways to alleviate some of that tightness is using a foam roller. So um, first thing we'll do is start kind of sitting on a foam roller. And walk your way up, keep your pelvis, keep your hips up, okay, keep everything nice and in line, neutral. I like to cross my arms. What that does is takes my shoulder blades out of the area a little bit, moves them out of the way so I can kind of work the tissue. And you walk up and down. If you find a tender area, you can kind of hold it. Keep yourself upright. Now, if this is too difficult to do, you can put your hands here and kind of help yourself this way. The next thing that I like to do, sometimes those muscles on the inside of the shoulder blades can also have some tension in them because they're kind of working, overworking a little bit. So what I do is turn the foam roller long ways. Again, lay down on it. Keep your pelvis in a good, uh, everything in line. Cross your arms again. You kind of work one side and work the other. Again, a few minutes, you find a tender spot, you kind of hold it there. The other thing you can do is you can actually take your arms, if your pecs can get a little bit tight as well, take your arms, lay them out and get a good stretch. The last one that's really good if you're hitting all these areas is hitting the lats as well. So this is pretty intense, so I like to kind of keep one hand down, arm up to get all these lat muscles because they get kind of tight from us working this motion, being tight down like this. So lat muscle kind of runs under the arm, kind of where your shoulder blade is, down in this area on the side of your body. So what we'll do is this way, you can kind of work. You can keep your butt down to take some pressure off. You can put your, lift your butt up, it's gonna put more pressure on the lat. Work different areas. The other thing, if you find a spot that's really tight, you can kind of hold, you can even work rolling forward or back just to kind of mash the muscle, get a little bit of um, pressure, you know, that can kind of help relieve some of those trigger points as well. The other thing you're getting by rolling is you're getting a little friction, so you're kind of frictioning the tissue, breaking some of the adhesions. If you have some of those, kind of loosen up some of the tissue that way. So you can roll this way, hold the hand this way if you need, you can have one foot here and rolling. Just find what's comfortable to you. Um, those are some simple things for posture, for loosening up. I like to use the foam roller before I um, grapple and train just to loosen me up, get my joints kind of warmed up, get some blood flowing in the tissue. Um, hope that helps.